What's going on guys, Steve Ramirez loves the earth here and today I'm going to show you the life hack of how these languages go. For example, Hebrew doesn't have a speech output for Google Translate. Bulgarian doesn't have that too. So I'm going to show you how this works. Let me unlock it with my face. And then I got this iPhone X load up right here. So you. You're going to need three translation apps, Google Translate, Yandex Translate, and Microsoft Translate. So what you want to do is to go to Google Translate and select the output for Hebrew. And I'm going to say something. Hello, how are you? So apparently Google Translate doesn't have a speech output for Hebrew. So, you're going to want to do is to go to Yandex Translate and then type he Hebrew and then you can say, hello, how are you? And then it does have a speech output for Yandex Translate. Let me just turn this up so that way you guys can hear. Shalom, ma shalom ha. Shalom, ma shalom ha. And let's see how this works. Hebrew Shalom Mashlam Ha Yes, the translation works. No speech output for Google Translate, but thanks to Yandex Translate. I'm going to show you another way how it works. So, you're going to want to select Bulgarian. Bulgarian. Bulgarian doesn't have a speech output. So, Bulgarian doesn't have it. So, if you go to Microsoft Translator, and then you're going to want to type is, Hello, how are you? Oh, that's Arabic. I meant to select Bulgarian. And it does have a speech output for, for Bulgarian. Zdravete, kak ste? Zdravete, kak ste? So I'm going to see how this works. Ezdravite kaste. Hello, how are you? Yes, it worked. It worked. I'm going to say in English. Bulgarian doesn't have a speech output in Google Translate. And it says speech output isn't available for this language. I'm going to try it again. I don't know why they make a speaker even though it says it here. So that's how it works. So Bulgarian doesn't have it. Hebrew doesn't have it. So if you want Hebrew speech output, go to Yandex Translate. And if you want Bulgarian speech output, go to Microsoft Translator. And that's it for this video. Hope you guys subscribe to my channel. Leave a like and a comment what you think about this video, about this life hack. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.